I'm Johnny Scoville, and this is Chase the Heat. This is a take two, because I just went off the rails on the take one. So I'm trying to do this as calmly as I can, because I couldn't have uploaded the first video. Um, I have two great pods from Jason Beard. They are the Deadpool, just a gorgeous pepper. And then I have the orange variant of the Deadpool, which is the Deadpool Orange, which is equally gorgeous. I'm gonna be eating these today. These were grown by Jason Beard. Now, uh, in 2022, he grew the hottest pepper I had eaten that year. So he grows some flame. There's no two ways about it. I ate, yesterday I ate a, uh, was it yesterday? I ate a primitale of his that was just stupid hot. So he grows some really great stuff. Before I get into this though, I wanna talk briefly. Um, yesterday I had a, a person who was a bus rider a subscriber of this channel for four years, um, uh, was, uh, a, has a bus pass, pays $4.99 a month for four months straight. Um, left me a nasty comment, okay, and used it. Uh, broke the rules of, of not just my channel, but online in general. Um, and the, the gist of this comment was he, he thinks that, and the reason he left that comment, that fortunately because it used inappropriate language, it was picked up and nobody saw it but me. Um, I emailed this person and asked them what their trouble was. And this is what they said. They said that they, they, there are some people that are suspicious, that have, are concerned about the, wart, the warthog. Said, he literally said that there are those who think that I, I simply said it was the hottest pepper I've ever had because Matthew Arthur is a close friend of mine. And I want to explain something to you. I've gotten to know Matthew more in the last three weeks, four weeks, than in the eight years since I've started the channel. The first time Matthew and I ever spoke on the phone was, two, was a week and a half ago, two weeks ago. And the more I know and the more I, I learn about Matthew and Carlo, the more I love them because they're good people. But I want to be really clear about something. This person was a subscriber for four years and for four months paid $4.99. That person is blocked. I'm not going to have people act like that on the channel. I want you to understand something. I said this to the email. The, to, I, I can't, you can't buy a, 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 a good review for me. I don't care how much money you threw at me. I'm never going to say a pepper is hot because you've asked me to or because you've tried to get me to, to for any reason at all. If Matthew Arthur was selling these seeds and then giving me a kickback, I can see why somebody would think that. Matthew Arthur is a stand-up human being and he's giving these seeds away. So I, a, a, you can't buy a, a, a review from me. You can't pay me to say something good about that. And if you want to be blocked from my channel, leave comments like that. And I'll be happy to block you. So I'm gonna cut these uh, Deadpool. These de now the Deadpool, listen, you need to understand that Deadpool was uh, created by a friend of mine named Jeff Remmert, who's a great dude and a really great grower and creator. All right, now look at the interior of the, of the, this is the regular Deadpool. Ready for the reveal? Look at the interior of this pod. Absolutely beautiful. It smells very, very hot. It smells fruity as can be though. Anyway, here's the, uh, the orange variant. Look at that. Look at the interior of that pod. Is that rough looking? So we have the Remmert and the Remmert Orange. We're gonna review these two pods. But just to be really clear, you can't, first of all, if you wanna stop leaving comments on this channel, leave nasty comments. Now, you can still watch. You know, I can't stop you from watching, but I can stop you from leaving terrible comments. So if you want to follow the, the same direction that person did, then leave nasty comments. This is a, a channel where it's positive. It's a positive message. I mean, 
We talk about sobriety, talk about a lot of positive things. Kids watch this channel. As a result, kids read the comments. That's why there are rules about leaving comments, what you can say and what you can't say. As far as free speech, there is no free speech on my platform. There's no free speech on Chase the Heat. If you say something that breaks the rules, you're going to be removed from, you're going to, I'll remove your ability to leave comments. Just thought I'd say that. My niceness, the problem is this, people misconstrue nice for weak, kindness for weakness, and that's a mistake. It's a really, it's a bad mistake to do that. Here's the Remert Red, grown by Jason Beard, who grows some flame. I'm Johnny Scoville, and this is Chase the Heat. Fruity and floral, right away. There was really no bitterness in that. It was fruity and floral the whole way. It was just floral and fruit fruity. The heat's in my throat and it's building. We're gonna let this build for just a little longer. By the way, um, the person that left the comment, I, I know who they are. You know, their comment doesn't say their name, but I know who they are. Um, it's interesting. Rules exist for a reason. And the rules on this channel exist so that children can see it and not be offended and have their innocence stolen from them by reading things they shouldn't be reading in comments that you've left. 99. 99% of the people who follow this channel are the salt of the earth. They follow the rules, they're here for the right reasons. It's that teeny small percentage that causes problems, but the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few, and that kids are gonna be watching this channel dictate what I allow to be said on this channel. Makes sense, right? Um, the heat on that was great. Um, that's an eight to a 10 for a chili head. If you're a chili head, it's, it's a very, very hot pod. The burn is not in my throat so much, it's more in my mouth, on the cheeks, on the inside of the cheeks and my tongue, more so than my throat. I think it's peaked out. We're gonna try this one now, the, the orange variant. And boy, the placenta, on, especially on this side, is just ridiculous looking, isn't it? So I'm gonna check the, the difference in the flavor and in heat of the orange versus the red. That's odd because I would have guessed ahead of time, I would have guessed that the orange would have been fruitier than the red, but the red one was fruitier flavored. I like the flavor of the red one better. And the red one is hotter than the orange one is. Which is really weird because I would still say that the orange is an eight to a 10 for a chili head. I give them the same rating, eight to a 10 for both, but the, the red one was hotter.
Let's see if the heat's gonna climb at all. I think it's gonna probably stay there. Um, the flavor on both of them were great. They're both uh, fruity. Um, I like the red one better. The orange one was just less fruity. Like a fruity is a spectrum, not so fruity, really fruity. The red was like over here, the orange was like right here somewhere. But the flavor on them was, they were both flavored great. I just preferred the red one more than the, uh, the orange one. But I have some more great peppers from Jason. He has, uh, there's another chocolate primatale that I'm gonna eat. Um, there's a uh, primatale cross, which is pretty cool looking. I'm gonna look forward to eating that one as well. But be kind to somebody today. And remember the rules here. Rules exist for a reason. Remember that children watch this channel. Let's keep that in mind. Um, and to anybody who thinks that, seriously, I, 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 a review can't be purchased from me. So to think that I would say a review because I'm friends with somebody is really the most absurd thing in the world. But I thought, I just thought I would talk about that. Just seen the first video. Holy moly. Kind of went off the rails a little bit. Um, the burn on both of those, by the way, was mouth burn, not throat burn. Um, my tongue burned more than the cheeks of my mouth or my lips. Really, the tongue was, my tongue was what got burned the most with those two peppers. All right, so we're gonna wrap it up now. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do another video this afternoon. I might, we will see. Um, between now and then, be kind to somebody, tell somebody you love them. In the description box, you're gonna see a link for all the normal stuff. Um, Jason Beard is gonna be in the description box. Um, I don't know if he's got pods for sale, but if you can buy pods from him, I'll tell you something, you'll do a really good thing for yourself because he grows some really great peppers. So Jason Beer is in the description box. Right here is uh, my son, Johnny Scoble Jr. and the lifeboat. Up here, Pepperology, which is geared towards brand new chili heads. A lot of good information about it. A lot of good information for new chili heads. And uh, the 26 most, most painful uh, challenges I've done since this journey began. Thank you for watching me. Thank you for hanging out. I'm Johnny Scoble. And this was Chase the Heat.